Hey guys, it's Fiend and Cave, and we have a very special thing to talk about today. It is the Phantom 84th anniversary of it being in the well, it, from it being published in a newspaper back in 1936. So, how good is that? Now, I personally, I am a Phantom fan from, I think, 2016 or something, a couple of years ago. And what we have to show you today is that a couple of years ago, the Phantom had turned 80 years old. And that's pretty cool. And here it is, the Phantom 80th Anniversary Special. And it also comes with an 80th anniversary extra which is pretty cool as well and it has eight decades eight stories eight countries including seven foreign phantom stories in published for the first time in english so that's pretty cool as well and yeah i've been i've been a phantom fan since 2016 yeah boy and yeah, i've been I've been getting from a local news agency ever since then. So, yeah. I have comics like, uh, I'll pull them out for you. I have comics like this. Mm, what are we going to have a look at? We have the Wedding Special. Came out a couple of I think, 2018 or 2017 came out on... Um, uh, this is my oldest, oldest phantom. It's number 643. Look at that mint stuff. It's not mint, it's just, it's got a little bit of damage here and on the back cover. Uh, but all the story is contact, in contact. Um, uh, the blockbuster issue. It's pretty cool. Got that from when I was up at Toy Dads a couple of, uh, probably last year. Um, Twenty seventeen annual. Now this I think was my first annual that I got. A couple uh, twenty seventeen. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, last one. Which one? Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, this comic here, if you can see it, was one, was one of my first, well, this one was my first ever comic that I got from, that I did get from my local news agency and it is the Phantoms World number one so it's, yeah, it's pretty cool and this is when, back when Phantoms World was actually a single issue thing like they had it on, like, they had it doing like 36 pages ones and yeah I think this one's by as a cover artist is by Angelo Todaro I think it is yeah and it's pretty cool and yeah and the second one of that is And this one was my first ever Christmas special, which is pretty cool as well. I'll find that other one. Here, this is issue number two and number three part series. It's still got the price tag on there because it's too hard to pull off unless not written. I couldn't all the scratches on it. So, yeah, I do take a lot of care in my. Phantom comics. I like to make sure they're all organized and all that sort of stuff. And yeah, and this also is a Romando Felmang story. 
and art. I'll show you the first one that I got. First comic artist that I fell in love with was... First comic artist that I fell in love with of his art was in Ant Antonio Lemos. His art, I loved it because of the like the colors he used and how he blends it in sometimes most of the time and yeah and that's all for today happy phantom day today and from all of us from me from phantom cave keep on phantom cave